The Ugly Duckling. Once upon a time, a duck sat on a nest of eggs. Day after day, she sat and sat until the eggs began to crack. How can five yellow ducklings? They were fluffy and yellow. One egg was left in the nest, and then a crack too. Out popped a big gray duckling. Who are you? said Mother Duck. Go away! Go away! You are ugly. Chuckled the five yellow ducklings. Every day, the ugly duckling grew bigger and bigger, and uglier and uglier. My other ducks came to look at him. "You are ugly," they said. The ugly duckling grew very sad. "No one wants me," he said as he swam in the river. The other ducklings teased him. Big ducks teased at him, and the ugly duckling grew sadder and sadder. No one wants me. Thought the ugly duckling, "I'm going to run away." So he swam sadly off down the river. After a long time. He met some wild ducks. They looked at him and said, "My, you are ugly." Then the wild ducklings flew away. They left the ugly duckling all alone. Each day, the winds grew colder. The leaves fall off the trees. And then it started to snow. The poor ugly duckling swam along in the river. Then the river turned to ice. It was winter. Duckling hid among the reeds. He was cold and hungry, and he was all alone. A long time. The ice began to melt. The trees put on leaves. The sun shined. The sky was blue, and the birds began to sing. Slowly, the duckling fold his feathers. He walked down to the river. He sat into the water, and he began to swim. Then he looked down at the water. To his amazement, he saw a beautiful bird with a long, long neck. Who is that? As an ugly duckling, suddenly he is heard the flapping of wings. He looked up, and he saw other birds in the water. And they were beautiful too. The beautiful birds lay in the water. They were around the duckling, and they began to ask him, "Who are you?" Asked the ugly duckling. "We are ones like you." They, but I am ugly duckling," he said. Look at yourself," said the ones. And he, Duckling, looked up, and he looked. The ugly Duckling was not an ugly Duckling anymore. He was a beautiful swan. "I'm swan like you," he said. "I found my every one family." 
and he laughed happily ever after.